Hi, I'm Daniel Neuberger, and I'm a technical service engineer at Xerost. Today, we'll be looking at five different methods of effectively sealing our VCI bags, heat sealing them closed, using our zipper bags, taping bags closed, zip tying bags, and stapling bags closed. Finally, we'll be looking at using interleaving sheets when we're dealing with bulk packaging applications. VCI bags contain our VCI chemistry, or volatile corrosion inhibiting chemistry, which releases from the bag and coats and protects metal parts. VCI bags must be effectively sealed to keep in and build up the concentration of protective VCI molecules inside of the bag, and to keep out the corrosion causing factors such as humidity, oxygen, and other corrosive gases potentially present in the ambient air outside of the packaging. Consequently, heat sealing VCI bags is always the preferred method, but this is not always practical. Fortunately, in most cases, it's enough to significantly reduce the airflow in and out of the packaging by using one of the following methods. Inspect the VCI bags for any rips or tears. Repair any small tears or holes in VCI bags with tape. Discard soiled and badly damaged bags. Contact your Xerost XCore representative and let us help you design a comprehensive corrosion management solution for your specific rust prevention needs.